Hey everyone, I want to make a quick video about an issue that I'm having with this 2005 E46 BMW 325CI. Uh, having a cam sensor, intake cam sensor signal duration issue. Um, it's weird. I uh, also originally had a crank sensor issue. Uh, I pulled the crank sensor out. It was split, as they will do. Uh, replace that one. Fix that code. So I figured with the cam code, maybe it's the same thing. Replace the cam sensor. Still had the exact same code. Uh, so I just put the original uh, sensor back in there uh, since I figured it wasn't a sensor issue. Um, and now I'm doing a lot of testing. And what I've got with my multimeter set up here is, here's cam sensor one. Here's the power, comes down in, splits off, goes to sensor two, and uh, maybe and some other things. Uh, here's the ground from the DME. Here is the signal wire, it's yellow. Uh, it goes into pin 29 on the DME, which is right back down in there. Uh, so, when I try starting it, uh, everything is hooked up as it should be right now. Um, getting a little bit of a hiccup right after startup. And sometimes the battery light will flash. Uh, up here you can see the car is asleep right now. I've got zero volts essentially on that um, cam sensor signal wire. So, I'll see if the battery light comes on when we can get this hiccup. And, interesting enough, where's my 5 volts? So it's not showing 5 volts yet. Maybe it's not waking up. Um, so I'll start cranking. Obviously it's getting voltage. Oh, damn it. I don't know if you saw that, but you could probably hear it. Let me do it again. There it is. And then it just evens out. Uh, and what I'm getting as far as voltage is two and a half on average, which is what I probably expect to see coming off of that signal line for the cam sensor. Even though I don't have an oscilloscope yet. <laughs> Let me show you something. So I unplug that intake cam sensor. Come back around. So getting the five volt reference, but when I start, it doesn't hiccup. So obviously it's giving me the signal at the DME when the car is running. Um, it's something that happens, I don't know if there's a relay right after it seems I, when I've done some testing before it seems to be <clears throat> almost RPM based instead of time based or maybe as soon as the ECU thinks that the engine is actually running because I've had times where it will run poorly at 400 RPMs and then as it starts to climb in RPMs it will do that uh, hiccup and sometimes it'll stall the engine um, <clears throat> I have a good battery in the back, but I have also hooked up a second battery here just to make sure that I've got enough juice coming up directly. Um, maybe an alternator? I don't know. I've, I've tested the juice coming out of the alternator with it running, and it seems to be powering up fine. It comes on within, you know, I don't know, five seconds. It's up at 14.